selling your house? Thornton's Property. Experienced local staff that deliver the best results. Proud sponsors of Saints TV. All right, so fantastic result for us last Saturday. Um, was that a bit of a confidence boost for the team and how are you going to try and replicate that success? Well, I mean, it was a perfect response after you know, losing to Aberdeen and um, it should give the players confidence, but, um, you know, we've been here before this season. Their season's been a wee bit stop and start. You know, Hibs game, you think we'd be able to kick on after that and we haven't, but uh, the away form's been really good. We've got to try and make sure that the, the home form uh, replicates the, the away form. Um, the performance at Everton on Saturday had energy, it had control, it had quality, and um, we've got to try and um, bring all those qualities into Saturday's game, which is going to be a tough game. Okay, so a few players who hadn't seen many minutes so far this season were involved last Saturday. Are we likely to see more of them in upcoming matches? Well, I mean, I've always tried to utilise the squad. And I thought on Saturday it was important that we got um, fresh legs in um, after you know a tough game on the Wednesday night. And um, the players that come in did extremely well. So um, this week's a different game. Um, we'll wait and see what, what what team you know I decide on. Okay, and how is the team looking ahead of Saturday? Good. I mean, obviously you would imagine. Uh, rightly so that everybody's buzzing after the result that they got and the performance they got and we've had a good week's training um, Eastie's been able to and Aaron Comrie have been able to take part in training this week uh, so um, it's been a really good week but um, Monday to Friday can help you prepare for uh, Saturday uh, but ultimately it's what happens on a Saturday that counts um, So we obviously had a great weekend but so did Hearts uh, beating Celtic 4-0 um, last time we faced them, we lost 1-0 at Murrayfield. So what are you expecting from them? A tough game. Um, there wasn't much in between the two sides at, uh, at Murrayfield. I mean, arguably David probably had a, uh, the best chance of the game when he didn't really get a good contact in the shot. A game of very few chances, to be fair. And they get to deflect it, uh, you know, go for the winner. Um, so um, they're personnel with due to injuries and that and young players coming in has changed a little bit but I'm expecting a tough game I mean they for them to get that result against Celtic was incredible uh, and they had a really top performance and um, played uh, like a team full of confidence so we've got to make sure that um, we're uh, ready for what they've got and, and make sure we can cause them problems. Okay and so we have three games left in December um, are you looking to finish the year strong? Yeah, I mean, I think by this, by the end of the split last year before the winter break, we had 29 points, so um, we're not far off that target. We've got to try, we'll probably have one game less because of Muller will. Um, so if we can, you know, get um, a couple of wins um, and, um, you know, get to 30 points, it would be a you know decent going into the break. All right, thank you very much. Cheers. Thank you.